uh, students uh, now we will discuss the methods of social work which are uh, considered to be the backbone of social work uh, discipline social work profession uh, which is important to know for all the social work practitioners to uh, work in the domain of social work discipline in the field on all the uh, social work settings uh, in the field uh, first of all we will discuss the primary methods of social work social case work uh, a primary method of social work is concerned with the adjustment and development of individual towards more satisfying human relationships and the uh, the satisfying human relationships can be acquired and depend on the use of uh, the resources used by the individuals in the society sometimes due to certain factors internal external the individual fails to avail the existing facil facilities uh, in the society or uh, found in the community in such situations social case worker intervene to help that individual social case work is uh, basically a one to one relationship which works in helping the individual for his or her adjustment and development in the society every individual uh, this is important to understand for the social case worker that every individual re reacts differently to his social economic and physical environments and as such problems of individual are different from those of another the practice of case work is a humanistic attempt for helping people who have difficulty in coping with their problems uh, of their daily living it is uh, one of the direct method of social work social case work is the primary direct method of social work profession which uses the case by case approach for dealing with individuals or families as regards uh, to their problems of uh, uh, social functioning case work aims uh, basically at individualized services in the field of social work in order to help the client to adjust with with their environment um if we see the historical perspective of social case work uh we see that professional method of social case work originated in usa in the second decade of uh, the century and uh, one of the earliest organized effort Uh, for social case work for the uh, origination of social case work was the establishment of the american charity organization society in uh, 1877 on the pattern of the charity organize uh, organization of london which was uh, started 7 years earlier uh one of the aim of the society was to find out ways and means of uh, helping the poor and needy and thus to organize individualized services uh to uh, to get this purpose the society used volunteers in the beginning who were called uh, friendly visitors to visit the homes of the poor for purpose uh, of uh, assessing their need for rendering material uh, assistance and for giving them guidance and advice so they can tackle their uh, uh, daily living problems the these friendly visitors were subsequently supplemented by paid agent and these paid helpers gradually developed systematic procedures in performing their task they collected data about the needy individuals and families and helped them after assessing their needs uh they also maintained records in which they kept all the information including personal including personal data uh, the information regarding the socio economic situations uh, of uh, uh, the service users as well as the type of the service rendered by them it was out of the practice of these early workers that case uh, uh, work developed gradually to a professional method in subs uh, subsequent years 
Their collective experience of knowing the poor families and their problems and the concurrent studies of poverty by social scientists broadened the understanding of human behavior. And there was the growing recognition that uh, there were forces within the individual and forces external to him, which influenced his behavior and the nature of ex his existence in the society. Um, later on, in course of the time, the term paid agents and the poor were supplemented uh, by the caseworkers and uh, clients, respectively, in the terminology of the help giving uh, help giving organization and the office of the organization came to be known as the agency so what kind of uh, uh, the help they were entering and uh, what were the causes of the human problems as conceived by social case workers uh, at the time uh, they felt that uh, the individuals were facing and the families were facing the problems of lack of material resources, like a like, uh, lack of uh, medicine, uh, blood, and uh, other financial resources. And uh, sometimes the individuals were having the misconceptions about situations and relationships and lack of appropriate information, uh, like uh, um, uh, uh, what kind of the situ real uh, situation is existing in the society and they didn't have the appropriate information. Uh, so, and the, the other problems included like illness or health related handicaps, like uh, they were in need of uh, wheelchair, artificial organs, therapeutic measures. Uh, some, uh, the, uh, the causes of uh, some problems were the emotional distress resulting from stressful situations, like uh, uh, some individual faced exam phobia, some individuals were uh, suffering from harassment and have developed the emotional distress because of uh, uh, the incidence of uh, harassment um, at uh, public places, at their workplaces. So uh, this was also the problem the individuals were facing. And then, the personality features or the deficiencies uh, of, on the part of the individual, like childhood disorders, domestic violence, or uh, uh, personality uh, disorders due to some peculiar experiences in their childhood or in their socialization. So uh, then, uh, as we have seen, the professional social case work originated. So uh, if we see that how can we define the social case work as a primary method of social work, there is a great name in this regard, Mary Richmond, who defines social case work as the art of doing different things with different people, uh, cooperating with them to achieve some of their own goals, some of their own betterment and society's betterment as well, society's welfare as well. Mary Richmond defined social work as uh, the art of bringing about better adjustment in the social relationship of individual men or women or children. And uh, according to her, social work means those processes which develop personality through adjustment consciously affected uh, individual by individual between men and their social environment. Uh, social case work defined by Jarrett in 1919, uh, and according to him, that social work is the art of bringing an individual who is in a condition of social disorder into the best possible relation with all the parts of his environment. Uh, similarly, social case work, uh, according to Taft in 1920, uh, defined by Taft that social, social case work is a social treatment of a maladjusted individual involving an attempt to understand his personality, an attempt to understand his behavior and social relationship 
and to assist him in working out better social and personal adjustment. Uh, Watson defined social casework uh, as the art of untangling and restructuring the twisted personality in such a manner that the individual can adjust himself to his environment in a better way. Then, uh, Tao uh, defined social casework as one method by which certain social services are made available in the areas of unmet needs. Means the unmet needs are met by acquiring specific social services which are required for this purpose. Then Bowers also defined social casework uh, like an art in which knowledge of the science of human relations and skill in relationships are used to mobilize capacities in the individual and resources in the community appropriate for better adjustment between the client and all or any part of his total environment. So this is uh, all about the social casework. Uh, that social casework is a process through which the better adjustment of the individual, better adjustment between the individual and the environment is made uh, by using certain techniques and approaches and principles of social casework. Then Hollis defined social casework as a method employed by social workers to help individuals uh, to find solutions to problems of social adjustment which they are unable to handle in satisfactory way by their own efforts. And uh, uh, casework was also defined by Gordon Hamilton in 1956. Uh, social casework uh, which is both a tool and area of work, which is a field of social work as well as an instrument, a device, a method of social work, and consists of those processes which develop personality through adjustment consciously affected individual by individual between man and his social environment. Um, according to her, social casework, uh, in social casework, the client is stimulated to participate in the study of his situation, to share plans, to make an, effect, uh, to make an effective effort to solve his problems using his own resources, using his own capabilities, uh, using his own, developing by his own capacity to solve the problem and whatever community resources are available, uh, the appropriate community resources uh, available uh, and can be used to help that individual. And uh, similarly, Paul Mann in 1957 defined social casework uh, as uh, a process uh, which is used uh, by certain human welfare agencies to help individual to cope more effectively uh, with their problems in social functioning, to enhance their social functioning, to enhance the social functioning of the individuals. Uh, then, uh, according to Seffrad, social casework is a method employed by a social worker to help individual find a solution of their problem of social adjustment, uh, which they are unable to help in their individual capacity and in a more satisfactory way by their own efforts. Uh, then Queen defined social casework uh, with the course of time in 1932 that uh, social casework is the art of adjusting personal relationship because the focus of casework is on the individual and on the, on the adjustment of the personal relationship. And uh, according to Lee, the social casework is the art of changing human attitudes. So the better adjustment can be made until and unless a uh, better change is brought in the attitude of that individual, in the human attitudes. 
And social casework was also defined by Tyler in 1926, that social casework is a process concerned with the understanding of the individual in a comprehensive way as a whole personality and with the uh, adjustment of these two socially healthy lives. So basic, we see from these definitions of social casework by uh, numerous uh, social scientists and social work practitioners that uh, the major objective of uh, using the social casework method is to uh, create the socially healthy environment for the individual and the socially healthy individuals for the society on the other side. Uh, simultaneously, Reynolds in 1935 defined social casework and talked about the social casework that it's a process of counseling with a client on a problem which are essentially his own uh, involving some difficulty is, uh, in his social relationship or when, uh, wherever the individual face the difficulty in their social relationship, in their social adjustment. So uh, here the case worker intervene and tries to help that individual to come out of to come out of this difficult situation for the better adjustment uh, then social casework was defined from another way is uh, the uh, that social casework is that form of social work is a method of social work is that type of social work profession which assists the individual uh, which is suggests to relate himself to his family his uh, natural group, his community, and his total environment. Uh, basically, social casework is a technical method in social work, a way of adjusting to the client, to his personal problems. All the efforts are made by the social caseworkers to uh, seek out the ways, to find out the ways in which the better adjustment for the client can be made with his personal problems with the environment, with these relations. According to Swift, social casework is the art of assisting the individual, is the art of helping the individual in developing and making use of his personal capacity, his personal potential to enhance the individual's capability to deal, to solve uh, individual problem, to deal with the problem which he faces in his life, which he which he faces difficult, which he feels difficult to uh, tackle, to handle. In 1939, by the social casework was uh, uh, understood as uh, the means, uh, uh, those, uh, as the means, uh, those processes involved in giving service, financial assistance, or personal counsel to individual by the representatives of social agencies uh, because uh, uh, social casework uh, as the method of social work profession and, the prof and this profession of social, uh, social work is rendered under the umbrella of the social welfare agencies. Uh, and, according to, uh, and according to the policies established uh, by this agency, and with consideration of individual needs according to the uh, dynamics of the needs of the individuals. And uh, we see that social casework is the process of assisting the individual to best possible uh, social adjustment through the use of social case study, social resources, and uh, knowledge from relative fields of learning.